It is snowing, finally, here in Canton, Ohio. We have about five inches on the ground. I thought, hey, let's go outside and do some filming because it's cold. It's really cold, to be honest. But this is a dwarf burning bush that I did some trimming on two years ago. And this is a little update to see where it's at. I'm not going to show you. All right, guys. So. I just wanted to show you some up close in here. Um, as you can see, lots of little trunks in there. So I'm gonna thin those out and uh, kind of focus, keep majority of the leaves up top and, and the, uh, the other branches. And we wanna kind of get the effect of the, of the uh, red bud over there, which is, uh, we're gonna have a little video on that one too because it's grown up against the house and we need to get that trimmed back. But um, underneath here, you can see, we're just gonna clean this all up. The great thing about this, this plant is the, is the bark and uh, it's called winged euonymus. And if you look, if you take a cross section, it's kind of hard to see. Yeah, here we go, there's a good one. There's actually, if you can see the brown, eh, we're a little out of focus there, but there's like brown striations. And um, I'm just gonna go around here and same thing all around this and uh, turn into a tree. Talk to you soon. Okay, got a lot of the bottom cleaned up there. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go around and start taking off some of the smaller branches. You might remember this from two years ago, which would be, I guess, technically 2018. It is now February 1st, 2021, right in the middle of a pandemic. Yay. But this was a pretty full dwarf burning bush. Had branches going all the way down to the ground, and the video I did was turning this into a small ornamental tree. Dwarf burning bush actually get about 10 to 12 foot high and wide, believe it or not. And to me, they make a really cool multi-trunk ornamental tree. So that's why I did this. So I wanted to give a two-year update. Um, as you can see, I took a lot of the branches um, kind of in the middle off of this. And it was kind of out up in this area a little bit. It has now started to uh, start to branch down a little bit and kind of fill out on the top crown. Um, due to the stress of the trimming, we did have a lot of sucker growth down here at the very base and on the uh, surface roots around the, uh, the burning bush. So later on this summer, uh, probably early spring, I will go ahead and get these all trimmed off, see how it goes and see if they come back. Hopefully this is gonna be a lot less stress than what it was when, when I originally trimmed this out. The middle itself, there's a couple little things couple little sprouts that kind of came out but other than that it stayed pretty clear in the middle and all the sucker growth just kind of came uh, up from the surface roots down here so it looks great uh, especially with the snow on it so 
Uh, like I said, later on this spring, we're gonna do a update when, um, actually I'm gonna wait until all the leaves come out and then you can kind of see how it is um, at that point. So anytime you're trimming any kind of shrub, I will typically wait. Um, I don't do it late in the year, uh, just because if you trim those shrubs or those trees and they, that, that injury doesn't heal over before winter hits, it can really stress them out and sometimes it can kill them uh, depending on the plant. So these, any kind of plant material, very, very late winter um, when they're definitely dormant. Obviously it's dormant right now, it's February 1st. Um, could I trim it right now? Yeah, I could, but I'm probably gonna wait anyway. So late winter, early spring um, is when I would typically uh, trim this or sometime before we get into, uh, I guess the heat of the summer or after the heat of the summer, cause you don't want to overly stress the plant. So I will see you in a couple of months and it's beautiful. It's snowing. This is what I like about Ohio when it snows like this and the snow uh, sits on all the plants. So we will see you with an update soon.